I'm Marty Lafferty. The DCIA participates in the Digital Due Process Coalition, which advocates long overdue reform of the seriously outdated Electronic Communications Privacy Act. ECPA was written 30 years ago before widespread adoption of the Internet by consumers or the advent of cloud computing. While Americans expect that their homes and offices will not be subject to government searches of personal, financial, and medical records or reading of mail without a duly obtained search warrant, under current law, as soon as those records are scanned and stored in the cloud or the message is sent by email, the government has free access. The current status seriously undermines Fourth Amendment protections and violates fundamental privacy expectations of U.S. citizens. The Email Privacy Act in the House of Representatives and its companion ECPA Amendments Act in the Senate will protect consumer privacy, prevent government overreach, and foster continuing industry advancement and innovation. After five years of increasing momentum for ECPA reform, H.R. 699 now has the backing of 304 members of Congress, a significant majority of both parties. Each of these measures should be passed, as currently drafted, without further delay. The DCIA strongly supports the testimony of Chris Calabrese, Vice President Policy at the Center for Democracy and Technology during this week's House Judiciary Committee hearing on the subject, and we oppose those who spoke against his views. There is simply no need for the carve-outs sought by opponents to weaken privacy protections, circumvent judicial oversight, and evade the warrant requirement. Government agencies can already serve a subpoena and demand production of relevant materials, and the courts have regularly compelled individuals and companies to disclose their data and impose sanctions for noncompliance. We also support the views of Google's Director of Law Enforcement, Information and Security, Richard Zalgado, whose testimony cited the Riley versus California Supreme Court decision requiring law enforcement to obtain a warrant before searching digital content on a mobile phone, and the fact that four states have already updated their versions of ECPA. Currently proposed federal legislation to reform ECPA will provide the same level of safety and security to digital data as U.S. citizens already have for printed material. It is time, finally, to extend the Fourth Amendment to the digital age and bring basic privacy protection into the 21st century. Share wisely and take care.